Hi community, so in this video I'm going to share with you your homework for this coming week, your challenge should you choose to accept it. And the challenge is to, ma is to make a video telling us the origin story of your services. And I'm going to give you four letters to help you tell that story. S-S-P-P. -P. So what does this mean? The first S stands for struggle. What was it that motivated you to get into this field? to try to develop the skill or this to develop the service was it your own struggle was it the struggle of friends and family that you saw was it the some struggle in the world that you were really passionate about what motivated you to get into it the second s stands for solution what's the solution very what's the story very briefly of how you developed the solution did you study with a guru did you take some training courses have you been studying this topic for years did you uh, have some mountaintop experience that got you to develop that solution. Just tell us briefly what that is, that the story of that, the, the, the background of that that's, uh, development is. The third letter stands for proof. What proof do you have that the, um, that the solution works? Uh, do you, have you solved it in your own life? Have you solved it in the lives of friends? Uh, in your studies, maybe you came across some case study, not necessarily of your clients, but uh, just some case studies. Or even if you just want to provide us a couple of quick testimonials from people who have worked with you that's perfectly fine so that's the third P which is proof and then the fourth P stands for passion which is what was reiterate us for again as you finish the story reiterate what is what is the, the passion you have for for, for, for for this service in the world for the problem for this for the dream um, you're not only in it for the money and so tell us, give us the, the sense of that you're not just in it for the money. Okay, tell, tell us, share with us your passion. And remember, one of the things we've been practicing this past week in the videos is to transmit the energy. Think about the energy you want the audience to feel as they watch a video and then being more mindful to transmit that energy through your video. Okay, now, um, one more thing about this challenge is that I would like you to make what I call a stage two video. If you don't, know what I mean by stage one, stage two, stage three content. Just comment below and someone probably can do a quick summary for you. So a stage two video, here's how I recommend you doing it. First, think about the outline of what you're going to say. Okay, just keep it in mind, something to commit to memory. Just, you're not, not a script, this is important. You're not writing out exactly the words you're going to say, but just a brief outline, something you can even just Kind of remember in your in your head okay so that's that's the that's the first thing the next thing is to do a quick first take with the outline in mind just try it out on video record yourself talking through the outline and then just see how it goes next watch your first take and then see what you would want to do differently on the next take what you know how you can improve so on the second take now um, do a second take and just based on what what the outline is and based on how you want to improve do that second take. Now, here's the key. Sleep on it. Come back the next day and then watch the second take you did the previous day. And now do a third take, a third total take, okay? And in this third take, you are integrating uh, the fact that you've slept on it. Uh, so you'll, you'll be even more, um, you'll, you'll have integrated some more wisdom from your mind uh, from this, from, from, you know, from the, other, the previous day. So do the third take and the third take perhaps it's good enough to share with us and if so share it with us just in this private group if it's not good enough you could do a fourth and final take okay fourth and final take but that's it and then just upload it to us in the group I have one other um, suggestion for those of you who are a bit more advanced in doing video if you're in a, a beginner this is it that's all you know I, I look forward to your video but if you're a bit more advanced try using Try uploading the video to YouTube first and using this and after process after it processes use the stabilize function to stabilize it if you're doing this oh, I should mention try to do this outside when you're kind of slowly walking in a very safe path upload it to YouTube stabilize it download that YouTube video and then upload that that video file to us here in this group so have fun with the challenge and I look forward to watching your videos and commenting on them have a good week